Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your friendly neighborhood numpty me, and I'm about to do episode, or whatever, part 10. I don't fucking know, episode, whatever. I just finished part 8 and 9, so I'm going to do the next one. If it's fast, I'll do 11, and you guys know the drill. So, like, here we go. They're about to do a wedding funeral, which is, I don't even fucking know, man. This show is so... Welcome, Coop Nation. It's, it's a so. Season, a wedding and a funeral. Combined You're just creepy, Sam. With an oh so recent I feel weird saying that because my best friend's name is Sam, but like, whatever. The first meeting. Oh, cute. How the fuck are they going to do this in a funeral? <laughs> the death. <laughs> The flirting phase. What? Two banana? What the fuck? Okay, so that's how you flirt. You eat a banana. Is that Ryan? Oh yeah, because they both slept with him for experience. That's aggressive. Holy fuck. Yikes. The music's nice at least. Okay, that's so fucked up, man. I really want to know what happened to this chick's hands. Did they say it at any part? Has nobody noticed her hands? Really? Like, she had to have killed him. Her fucking hand- Like- They never said what happened to them, I swear to god. Okay. This priest is like, what the fuck is happening? Can priests swear? I mean, like, not in church, I guess, but I don't know. With the black pedals. Ha, <laughs> that's me! Never make me be a flower girl. Stand up. Oh, stand up. I'm gonna make people bow at my wedding. I love how half of the people are wearing black and half of the people are in color. Funeral, please. And also to honor the late Ryan Maisler, who was much beloved. Okay. <laughs> Stop it. You know, it's um, it's a love not unlike the quote throbbing and sensual love between Ivana and Blake. <clears throat> so let us just pause here together and remember our our dearly departed. Wedding. And I'll unpause. <laughs> pause, unpause, pause, unpause. Of Blake and Yvonne. Cough again. Go, go, little um, Nick Jonas. It says here that you would like for me to share that if you were not on lockdown, they would have loved to celebrate their vows in Fiji. That's right. We've never been, but. But nevertheless, you are happy to be here? No. Much <laughs> like me, after you sent me a gypsy cab to pick me up in North Hollywood, which was bone chillingly terrifying. You're welcome. Bone chillingly terrifying. So here we are to celebrate your love. Oh, and, what the hell is uh, going on with my hair? Like, like at least quote, go flat. Catch this. A mighty sword decapitates its victim with a clean sweep. So has the force of your passion for one another cut your doubts in half. Like Ryan. Okay, that's con it's concerning, man. To how Ryan was ruthlessly slain. Wedding! 
so has Blake slain this poor priest Ivana with the force of his love. I'm almost still in here, but before we conclude, I have been informed that we're going to have a speech for Dead Ryan, and then we're also going to have a toast for Blake and What's your face? <laughs> well, Father, that's for our viewers to decide. I'm sorry? Yes, that's how the show works. So whose poignant and undoubtedly well-written speech would you rather hear? A eulogy from Miles or Elton. A Elton, from we are Elton. Oh, oh shit, I wanted to hear the eulogy. Fuck. <sighs> Ivana and Blake. Wow. You're getting married. <laughs> I can't believe it. I regret my decision, <laughs> but I love funny. Elton. You two are proof that there is someone out there for everyone. Thank you. And that gives me hope. So here's to you. Fuck you. Yeah. Whatever weird cosplay sh you two kids got going on. Because <laughs> <Okay>. fuck you. How you know about the cosplay stuff? That's me as a wife. Okay. Now I'm sure you have some amazing <laughs> vowels. Would you like to start? I sorry. I'm gonna go. Okay. I uh, <clears throat> Ivana. 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 When I first met you, I was a very thirsty man. Mm. I was like a castaway on a faraway island. In Fiji, that hadn't had water in a very long time. Oh God! Only love was my water. Then you gave me a drink, a long, delicious, wet drink that I swallowed. What the fuck? And swallowed. Like, I also was like beach, arid, dry, sandy beach. I had nothing, no seagull, no water, and I met you. And all of a sudden, I'm like, yeah, I can do love with this guy. And now I can get wet forever and ever. Okay. That's terrifying. Mm. Mm. Can I have, do we have That's rings? That's disturbing. That yeah, this, we got uh, the rings. This, yeah, I got him. This alternate universe? <laughs> oh, I can't be a ring bearer or a flower girl. I dropped them for sure. <laughs> Don't look at me. Uh, look at Elton. With this ring. Oh. With this ring, I be wet. Push, push, push. Ah. Your turn. Okay. It's gonna cut off her blood ring. circulation. I gonna start the wedding you. Uh, a dude is dead. Shut up! Shut up, man! We're all clear that your buddy's dead. All right, so you need to shut up. You and your little cat bun deep neck need to shut up. Do this not talk to Nick Jonas thing. that way. Okay, so I'm gonna charge double. <laughs> Nick oh, Jonas up. is a god. So Ryan, you're missed. Jesus. Whatever. Any objections? Anybody I object. No, 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 no. I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm taking over right now. Is this my camera right here? Okay, you got three people to choose from for objections. You choose who you want to object, okay? You got Suicide Sally, you got Easter Basket, or you got oh God, Human Ink Basket. We're going to do okay, Miles. Your choice. Okay, so I have an objection to the funeral. When I first found out it wasn't DJ. Sorry, was Elton. Like, what if it's all of us? Yes! My favorite bedtime story, Murder on the Orient Express. What? But then I realized if it wasn't DJ and it wasn't me, then it can't be all of us. But now, now I know who it is. Someone who's smart, and it's someone who's strong, and it's someone who knows how to kill. Now look, I'm no snitch, okay? I don't want to name names. What if it was the guy in the basement? Fingers. What? Now they think Derek. Derek wasn't I even was in the house. What? Thank here. you. That's what I, I was just about to say. Prove it. I just opened my second location of my pet grooming franchise. It was the greatest day of my life. That's pathetic. I prove it to you. Nick Jonas be nice. I had my bag open already. Like that? Huh? You see that? My picture. He says that he was grooming pets, but what do you think, America? Is Derek in the clear? Yeah, we're actually gonna clear Derek. I don't think Derek. Thanks, but like, wow, Miles, I didn't kill Ryan. But you killed that bitch. Oh, well, that's a risk I was willing to take. I have enough friends. Oh, oh wow. Oh, wow, what a stunning display of America. This wasn't great. Thank great. you for letting me observe that. Is everybody else done talking except for me? Because I literally have two more things to say, and then I'm out. Are there any other objections? Okay, going once. Going twice. Okay, funeral clothes, wedding clothes, Blake and Iguana, your man and wife. Okay? You may now kiss the bride. 
Oh, it's gonna be so gross. Oh. Hey, I had an objection. Oh, Mary, you just missed it. Oh my God, good job. Have a seat. You did a terrible job. You did a terrible job. Oh my God. continues here on the coop as we head into our What the fuck are they doing? Reception with words from our maid of honor, our best man, and an open casket viewing of the dead star, Brian Nassler. So be there next time. It's happening now. It's happening here on the coop. On the coop. And that's all for that episode. Stay tuned for the next one. Have a good life, guys.